everyone. I'm Jill Moore and it's my pleasure to welcome you to this episode of the Douglas Haas Legacy Concerts brought to you by St. Andrew's Presbyterian Church in downtown Kitchener, Ontario in Canada. We're very lucky today to have a harpist as our guest. Lauded as a huge talent with hidden power and amazing maturity, Taiwanese-American harpist Dr. Noelle Wan made her international debut with the Utrecht Symphony Orchestra in 2010. She has performed across North America, Europe and Asia, and has been featured as a soloist at Carnegie Hall, Music Hibo, and the Yellow Barn Summer Music Festival. Her international distinctions are many and include first prize in the 2010 Dutch Harp Festival competition, grand prize in the 2014 Carmel Music Society competition, and second prize in the 2021 Prix Orfor Musique. Dr. Wan is an alumni of the University of Illinois and the Yale School of Music. As an educator and scholar, she has contributed to Harp Column, The Collective, The American Harp Journal, where she has written on philosophy, music education, and feminism. She currently lives in Kitchener, Ontario, and serves as assistant professor of harp in Western University's Don Wright Faculty of Music. Today's program includes three beautiful and moving pieces. The first two works published in the 1980s by living composers, which is somewhat rare these days. From the Eastern Gate is the first piece by Alexina Louis. Our second piece is the Black Decameron with movement uh, Flight of the Lovers Through the Valley of Echoes by Leo Brower, transposition by Noel Wan. And finally, we'll have the introduction and variations on themes from Bellini's Norma by Elias Parrish Alvars. Please enjoy today's performance.
Thank you so much to harpist Noelle Wan for such a moving performance today. What a pleasure to hear the harp featured as a solo instrument. I'd also like to add a personal thank you today to Anne-Marie McDermott for continuing to curate such an incredible lineup of performers for us to listen to. And also thank you to Dave Mitchell for his magical sound and video work to create the final performances that we see when they air every two weeks. I'm so lucky to work with such talented people. Please join us next time to hear Katrina Liddell on the oboe. And now, whether you're joining us in real time or on replay, I trust this has been a welcome moment for you to rest and relax, be present, and just let the music wash over you and bring you peace, and hopefully turn out, tune out some of the noise of the world for a moment. Until next time, take care, stay well, and be kind. We'll see you soon. <laughs>